Uvuvi kwenye Ziwa Victoria ndio riziki ya kipekee kwa idadi kubwa ya vijana wengi wa umri wa miaka kumi na nane kwenda juu. Maisha yao yamefungamana na ziwa kwani kuanzia umri mdogo vijana wengi huandamana na wazazi wao kuogelea au kucheza ziwani wakati wazazi wao wakijihusisha na shughuli zinazotokana na ziwa hilo. Ndiyo taswira kamili ya Joseph Odoyo kutoka ufo wa Sirongo eneo la Bondo kaunti ya Siaya. Baada ya hali ngumu ya kiuchumi kumpelekea kuacha masomo yake akiwa kidato cha pili, Joseph hakuwa na mahali pengine pa kujipatia riziki ila tu ziwa la Victoria ambalo ndilo ziwa la pili kwa ukubwa duniani la maji safi. Alijiunga na timu ya wavuvi wa changa ambao walibobi uvuvi wa samaki aina ya omena na kila jioni walipiga makasi ya boti zao ili kutafuta samaki hawa wadogo. Lakini Joseph hakujua kama siku moja atakuwa mtaalamu wa kutengeneza boti. Kasi hii nilianza miaka wa 10 na 2012. Nilijifunza tu nilijifunza kwa rafiki yangu ili nijikimu kimaisha. Mwanzo nilikuwa ninaishi huko Uganda ndio nilijifunza hii kasi kwa rafiki yangu. Na huko nilienda kwa kufua tu nini omena ndio nikakutana na rafiki yangu akanifunza hii kazi. Baada ya kujifunza kazi hii kutoa kwa rafiki ye, Joseph aliamua kurejea nyumbani na kuanzisha kituo chake kwenye ufuo wa Sirongo ili kuwa karibu na familia yake. Lakini mara kwa mara yeye usafiri nje kufanya kazi za ukarabati wa boti kila anapoitwa. Hii kazi nilijifunza kwa sababu nilikuwa na nilikuwa na penda sana kukaa na, na nini kwa, kwa fundi na nilikuwa na mafikirio ya kwamba siku nyingine nitapata kitu ya kufanya tofauti na kasi ya nini kufua ninafanya repair ninajenga mingi kwa beach mbalimbali mbali. we are about five people who are doing this work like uh, here only this in, in, in this village we, we are we are we are three and the others there are some two that is coming from the, the other beach called Liunda. Ni kazi ambayo haikosi changamoto kwani kwa misimu ambayo samaki ni wachache inamlazimu kufanya kazi ya ujenzi. Average inaweza kuniletea kama 1015 1017 hivi. Mm of the time when the catches goes down some people nearly most of fishers fish fishermen they do migrate to the other beaches and here we now don't we now we don't have we don't have a work i mean those boats are now not there so we just seated we we don't have to do what to do yes and sometimes those boats are there there is no fish in the lake we are we now we just stuck at home we are we have nothing to do again i can join mjengo something like that yes anatoa imizo kwa vijana kujibidisha na kujipatia ujuzi utakaowawezesha kujipatia riziki badala ya kuzembea na kusubiri vitu za bure unajua wa vijana wafaa wapate kitu ya kufanya kwa maana mara mingi vijana ndio wanapata kwa vitendo kama wa, wa violence nini na ukiwa uko na kama uko na kitu inakuweka busy utakuwa u, utakuwa na utakuwa ukipata na utakuwa na kasi rahisi usio utapata kwa kwenye ma, ma, nini mapango mabaya